Rose. This is Martin Brundle challenging Gerhard Berger for second place in the Monaco Grand Prix and taking advantage of the fact that he's through. Mark, Martin Brundle, a master of Monaco. Sebastian Vettel and Mark Webber. Vettel on the inside. Has he now stolen the lead from his teammate? Can Webber scrap back? Oh, fantastic stuff. Mark Webber now from a long way back Verstappen on the outside Rosberg on the inside they come close but they don't quite touch Verstappen now under pressure again that's a brilliant exit from Nico Rosberg it's redemption day for Daniel Ricciardo he wins the Monaco Grand Prix and he will celebrate that for a long long time to come Sebastian Vettel comes home to take second place Mercedes threw everything at him today. Charles Leclerc has coped brilliantly. He won in Spa. He wins in Monza. Charles Leclerc is the winner of the 2019 Italian Grand Prix. Brilliant move from Lando Norris, who's ahead of Charles Leclerc. It's McLaren 1-2 at Monza after the safety car. Norris is completely fearless. He was on the grass at one point in the Curva Grande. And once again, Ralph out of position, and Barrichello makes it stick. Wow, what a move by Rubens Barrichello! Hamilton gets away well, and he's getting towards Max Verstappen now, he tries to cover him off and pushes him to the left hand side. Perez is in acres of space as Hamilton on the inside pushes Max Verstappen wide. Can Perez fight back? No, he can't. Hamilton is just ahead of Verstappen. Perez challenging his teammate around turn two. Hamilton leads from Verstappen, then comes Sergio Perez, and then the Charles Leclerc, Lewis Hamilton got the dream start that he wanted. Three times he's won here from second in the past. He has made a lightning start and leads the race as Carlos Sainz and Daniel Ricciardo tangle the Ferrari and the McLaren, almost touching wheels. Orlando Norris now makes a move on Felipe Massa and Daniel Ricciardo's in that fight and Nico Hulkenberg as well. And Massa's getting sorted out by the pack and down the inside goes Daniel Ricciardo. What a move from the Australian. He's picked up a couple of places in one corner. Desperation starts to creep in for Lewis Hamilton. Raikkonen's third, and that's is that Glock? Is that Glock going slowly? It is. That's it's Glock. Glock. Oh my goodness me! Hamilton's back in position again. A million, a hundred thousand local hearts sink in the grandstands. It's handed the place back to Hamilton. He comes through, and if I'm absolutely right, I'm sure that he is going to claim fifth place, which is all he needs to do to become yes. the 2008 Formula One World Champion, Lewis Hamilton a little bit too wide himself but he's still going for it and this time he does want to get the job done going into Brooklyn but once again Fernando Alonso fights back and just will not give up this fifth place Vettel now switches to the inside Alonso does he have to give up they're going wheel to wheel somehow not touching as they go round Woodcut and on towards Cox where Alonso passed Vettel on the outside a few laps are going on the inside Sebastian Vettel gets it done this time no man wanted to yield. Bottas and Hamilton getting away ahead of Verstappen and Perez and the wheel to wheel the Mercedes but what's happening behind? Perez pulls to the inside, Verstappen to the outside, they're three abreast at the moment and there's three abreast behind them into two, will we go, Verstappen is into the lead, ahead of Hamilton Bottas gets tagged by Daniel Ricciardo, Perez goes onto the grass and it's an all sorts of kerfuffle going on in that first corner, there's Yuki Tsunoda getting hit in the Alfa Atari as well, Verstappen leads from Hamilton, Pierre Challenging Sergio Perez, and Perez just stays ahead. This time it's Schumacher challenging Mika Hacken, and he's going to give him a hard time right from the beginning. And he's got that's that's where he got a penalty last year under a yellow flag. He's all right this year, and he's really harrying Mika Hacken. Is the Finn going to be able to resist the pressure? And the answer, I think, is going to be no. Schumacher. But Schumacher's going to lead. He's right in front now. Schumacher Hacken fights back, and through goes Fisi Keller. Squeeze past, they're going wheel to wheel towards Vale now. Who's going to be last on the brakes? Leclerc has that inside line. Perez goes off the track, cuts the chicane. Golf goes Leclerc, through goes Hamilton. Unbelievable stuff. It's Verstappen, far enough back. He's going to make the lunge down the inside. Hamilton sees it coming. It's a late lunge by Verstappen, who takes the lead of the race. Brand new season, brand new dawn for Formula One. It's the Bahrain Grand Prix. And it's lights out and away we go!
Hey, hey everyone. Welcome to Melbourne Race Weekend F1. Thank you so much for the fill. And to everyone that grabbed spots in the mini, good luck. Good luck. I can't wait. It seems like forever ago um, that we did Melbourne F1. It's only been 12 months, obviously, but man, it feels like ages. I can't wait to see how we go. We've got some fun stuff planned for the weekend. Um, a bit of a twist to the brakes this weekend, just in honor of that race weekend. But before then, let's see what kind of uh, bangers we can pull out of this one. This case has been piping hot in one of the boxes. Uh, pretty quiet as far as F1 goes for some of the others. Still obviously red hot, but a bit different. Two middle boxes absolutely aren't done. That was going to be my next question. So you've, uh, you've beat me to it. Let's do the two, do two double ones. Oh, mate. Yeah. What Cal's referring to there, I've been in traffic for about four to five of the hours of today. Um, just moving stock around and picking stock up. And my goodness, everyone's got what they need at their respective brake stations. But man, it was uh, not an easy one today. If you're from Melbourne, you'd be familiar with Bell Street. And let me tell you, I'm very familiar with Bell Street after today. I reckon I could... Uh, Draw you a sketch of the whole thing. Hey Dirk, how you going, mate? Good luck to you with your Alonzo spot. But hey, I saw a new name in there tonight as well. Someone who from overseas. Let me who do we have? Who do we have? Yeah, good. Now I don't know who it was. Anyway, I will welcome them. It was probably in the mini, actually. That makes sense. That's why I'm not seeing it. Yeah, it was Michael Day. Welcome, Michael, to your first Friday break and your first F1 break. So thank you very much for joining in. I'm going to run that mini in a second. See who runs away with the Piastri spots, the two Ferrari spots, and the Russell spot. Oh, mate, I might just get a big Trident van, just a big blue thing or something. I don't know. Absolutely hectic. Definitely racking up the Ks, but it's all, uh, all for good reason. One of the things I went and picked up for those of you MLB inclined. This absolute brand new banger. So that's up right now. That's coming uh, later tonight. It's so banging that the camera doesn't know what to do with it. In terms of focusing. Oh, for, had it there for a split second. That's the best we're going to do, apparently. The full boxer is live as well on the website. Um... Oh, there goes the spot. Thank you, Mike, if you're watching. Speaking of which. I'll take you across real quick to what's going on on the website, and then we will get into this mini. There we go. All right, so we've got four breaks still live. This one is practically closed. There's only one left, just the Nationals of 13 bucks, And that will close out Series 1, Hobby, Tums 3, and Logo Fractor, the beautiful, beautiful Logo Fractor. As soon as they start bringing that over to other uh, sports like F1, yeah, can you imagine with F1 uh, and with soccer and things like that, mate, it's going to be unbelievable. Uh, then we have got, speaking of the baseball, we're just saying the Inception, four boxes of it. Yeah, well, that's something quick, man. Uh, we've got the Angels at 36, Athletics at 25, Blue Jays at 29, Cubs at 25, Giants at 33, Guardians at 29, Rangers at 48, Rays at 39, Red Sox at 35, and the Yankees, big, big spot at 122. As you can see here, we saw a few cards in the preview from tops down the bottom here. Um, absolutely unbelievable. That, that booklet card goes absolutely crazy. Um, yeah, looks like it's going to be another hot Inception uh, release. Of course, the tops Inception, we did plenty of that absolutely off its head. So let's hope the Bowman Inception is even half as good. We'll be absolutely thrilled. Then in the soccer, we've got the Museum, which is now 15% off a checkout. That's moving very, very well. All slated to go tonight. Liverpool... Gerard Keegan at 59, minus 15%, of course, all these numbers. Barcelona, Stoichkov, Klobert. Real Madrid, Carlos, Chabi and Alaba, Marseille, Bayern Munich, Beckenbauer and Müller. Leverkusen, AC Milan, Kakapa, Racy, Maldini, Juventus, Trezeguet, McKenny and Reina and Salzburg. And that's it. That's all we've got left in the museum. So that is looking good to break alongside the brand new release that's come out today. Road to the Euros, Top's Finest. We've seen how good Top's Finest is time and time and time again. This time, it's Euros get the top's finest treatment, so can't wait for that. Let's have a look at some of these cards here at the bottom. This is from Tops' preview they gave us. Absolutely unreal, that Harlan Ronaldo spot. Oh, speaking, I should actually mention, it's pretty important, Dan is doing that break tonight, so you know when Dan does a break, anything could happen. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> I reckon that Harlan Ronaldo might just be the uh, 
the minimum at this point when Dan's doing a break. Um, so we've got there Belgium, De Bruyne and Courtois at 88. Denmark, Schmeichel and others, 55. Keen, Shearer and Terry for England at 122. Zidane and Colomani, surprisingly still there at 144. Germany, Musiala and Müller at 122. Germany, Matthaus, Samar and the other spot at 77. Ireland at 44. Israel at 44. Italy, Toto, sorry, Todi and Tonali. I'm already in my uh, F1 mode. And others at 99. Poland at 88. Switzerland at 33. And Ukraine at 88. So some very good spots left there. And we're doing the full case. So all eight boxes in the case are going in the one go. So can't wait to get into that one and see what the new finest brings us. Uh, and that is all she wrote for tonight. Um, so there's some massive fun. Two new releases there on the left. Obviously, F1 Chrome, which is always a banger. This one with the beautiful logo fractor and museum collection, which can go as big as anything. So it's going to be one heck of a night. Now, we may as well go straight into the break sheet from while we're here. Make sure you guys can see what I can see. So we've got the four spots going off. So we've got <clears throat> Piastri, Leclerc, Sainz and others, and Russell and others for Mercedes. Um, and spots went from Ricky through to Aaron, who closed us out. Thank you, Aaron. So those 10, we're just going to spin them seven times as we usually do and pop them back in, see who gets the top four spots. So here we've got Ricky into Aaron going seven times. Once, twice, three, four, five, six. And final time. Seven. Bang. So we've got Lane at the top there. Aaron in second. Ben and then Phil Marku. So we'll copy that back across here. There we go. So Lane with the big Piastri spot. Aaron Tucker with the uh, Ferrari Leclerc spot. Ferrari signs and others went to Ben Innes. This time a bit of luck off the mini Ben. Good stuff. And Mercedes Russell and others going out to Phil Marku. He's had this Mercedes spot a couple times. It's done very well for him. So let's see if tonight is another night where that happens michael thanks for jumping into your first try and break unfortunately it wasn't to be there with that mini uh, but i think you also bought a spot in the bowman inception if i'm remembering correctly so hopefully have a bit more luck there later tonight yeah i mean f1 logo fractor can you imagine it Bear with me a sec while I put the uh, everyone's teams or drivers, I should say, on screen. And then let's do this thing. What surprises? Yeah, gosh, Diana went off last time, didn't it? Actually, let me shorten some of those because that's going to be a bit hard to read. Um, yeah, I mean, last time we got the Futura out of the way, we are still, of course, looking for Art de Grand Prix. We're looking for F1 armor and we're looking for numbered, I'd say numbered uh, legends and plenty of other things as well, of course. And let's abbreviate that to ADGP. We all know that's Art of Grand Prix. There we go. Ah, oh, that's a good one. Carl, thank you. Hidden gems. So hidden, I forgot about them. We haven't seen any, of course. Carl, to be honest, neither can mine. I don't know how many would make it to the screen because Jordy and I would probably buy them before they ever even uh, make it to a break. And we are doing the middle two boxes as per the request at the start of the stream. You know what the problem is there? That uh, a lot of people have that story, including me. I was only baseball. Now it's a soccer collection. Now it's an F1 collection. So I totally, totally get what you're saying there. It's happened to me as well. I think a lot of us watching this stream right now uh, feel that on a spiritual level. All right, so we're going those middle two boxes. So these two are going back in. 
Now, if tomorrow's breaks, they're going to be done by Dan, and I've just dropped a fresh case off of Dan. So these will be going later when we're with me next, um, which might be Sunday or Monday potentially. But tomorrow's one will be a fresh case from Dan. I'm going to crack open a new one. Yeah, we'll run some uh, run some fun that intertwines with the race and the qualifying tomorrow. Run a couple of uh, promos and things like that. Should be good. Get a bit interactive with it. All right, let's do it. Good luck, everyone. And thanks again for the clothes, for the fill, for everyone who grabbed their bits and pieces. See, you See if F1 Chrome can do it again. Also, Robert, congrats on grabbing the Red Bull spot. That's the first time I don't see Fidel Ray there. So, well done. If I do say Fidel, it is just simple force of habit. What do we reckon for the F1 this weekend? Do we see any surprises? Anyone that in some uh, wild spots where they shouldn't be? I'm not going to ask who's going to win because that's a boring question. All right, let's get into it. Kicking us off, Frederick Vesti in Prima. The F2 drivers today with Scott Marsh, Lewis Hamilton, with Phil Kaslik. And we are going straight into a purple, purple checker, X-Fractor, 199. And we have got Charles Leclerc. Very nice, number 92 of 199. And Leclerc is with Aaron Tucker off the mini there, so... Straight away, that is paying dividends. And off the back here, we have got an Amari Cordial. In the Invicta. Nice refractor. And I don't have a single sleeve on the table. Let me fix that. Amateur hour over here. Please hold. All right, pretend it didn't happen. Here we go. There we go. No delay at all. We'll put up Charles Leclerc. I think it's my first day. I see some orders rolling in. Thank you very much, everyone. Keep this night going. Ralph Washington for F2 Camp also. Oh, and I see a nice color on the back there. Felipe Drogovic for MP Motorsport. And it looks like we are going. We're going straight gold. No split colors here. This is the real thing. And I reckon it might be a Ferrari, which means one of these, this is going to come off the mini, either for Aaron or for Ben. It is... Oh, Scuderia Alpha Tauri, my... Apologies, I was winding up the wrong person. But that means that it's going out to Taran, who is starting some Nick DeVries collection. Hilarious, I know you're buying that spot for Ricciardo, but man, oh man, the last two breaks, have you got off with Nick DeVries? I've seen a Futuro to 25, and now a straight gold, which are absolutely beautiful on the tops. Nice rookie, 13 of 50. Check that out. I saw the word Scuderia, and I'm like, yeah, there's only one Scuderia team, isn't there? I'm so sorry, Aaron. My apologies, mate. Completely forgot about AlphaTauri's name last year. I'm like, yeah, they're called RB or VCarb or some nonsense. Nope, they were Scuderia AlphaTauri. Esteban Ocon in the 1977. I'll get you going, Aaron, I promise. I'll make up for that. You watch. We'll pull a bigger Ferrari than that. Now that I've done that, that's how this works. Nick is definitely stalking you. If you find a Nick collector, you trade them for every single Danny Rick card out there. Have you got the Nick DeVries auto account? 
13 of 50. Very nice card, though. Very, very nice. So yeah, we're two packs in. We've got a rookie straight gold to 50. Classic F1 Chrome things. All right, we've got the no sleeves on the table out of the way. We've got me calling the team the wrong name out of the way. Let's get professional now. Alex Albon into Max Verstappen winning at Mexico. Oscar Piastri, the chase of the day out to lane. And Sergio Perez in the camera. Oh, sweet, man. Was that actually me that hit it? Was it Dan? That doesn't matter either way. Oh, and we are going straight orange. Straight orange. F1 Chrome is not holding back in this box. Zane Maloney for Roden Carlin. Roy Nassani. We are going straight orange. 225. Let's have a look what it is. It is one Manuel Correa in the auto. Bang, that is massive. Scott Marsh with the F2 drivers. Very, very, very nice. Check that out. That is our second F2 Orange Auto. We did Theo Porsche a little while ago, so let me not forget about the car at the back here, which is Lewis Hamilton, driver of the day in Baku 2022. It's definitely me. Gosh, I've normally got a pretty good memory for those things. Forgotten my Nick DeVries auto. How rude. Very, very clean auto too. I'll show you in a sec. Bang. Three packs. We have got three numbered cards. One is gold, one is orange, one has an auto on it. Just another day at the office when you're breaking F1 Chrome. Unreal. Absolutely unreal. Three packs, two one touches, why not? Let's see what other madness this box has. Leclerc into Arthur Leclerc into Fernando Alonso and Charles Leclerc Ferrari featuring pretty heavily here early so far the one numbered card of course has only been four packs not the straight gold as I promised but still featuring quite heavily from Stanek in the Trident Lando Norris in McLaren of course Lewis Hamilton driver of the day in Spain and Charles Leclerc in the 1977 insert. Jack Crawford for high tech. Lewis from Mercedes Roman Stanek for Trident. And Lewis again in the camera. Lewis spot showing up strong as well. Yeah, true. Yeah, fifty younger uh, younger drives in this one. Absolutely, I agree. Alex Albon into Max Verstappen, Sergio Perez. And actually, I should say today those two are going out to Robert Petrovich. So a bit different. And we've got that looks like Michael Schumacher. It is in the camber out to Stuart Mary. And I was grabbing that legend spot. Love to see that go numbered again today. We saw we've seen two centers and a David Coulthard the other day. Oh, that wasn't numbered actually, but it was colored. The uh, dual color. We have got Enzo Fittipaldi into Charles Leclerc, and it looks like we're going straight purple. I got this right way around. I do. This time it really is a Ferrari. I was scared to say it. I saw the SCU. I was like, no, nah, we're just going to reveal it. Number two, 399. Nice. So there's two numbered Charles Leclerc's off that mini spot so far already. Doing good there, Aaron. Slowly recovering from that gold scare. And Isak Hajar in the high-tech refractor.
And actually, I just noticed and just realized that is Charles Leclerc's driver of the day in Melbourne a couple of years ago. So that is a good one for this weekend. That was the year. That was the year I thought maybe Red Bull was in trouble with the start that Ferrari had. 2022. And then Red Bull went Super Saiyan, Ferrari imploded, and the rest is history. Danny Rick. Sorry, Taron. He is in the McLaren here. That puts him in the Norris another spot at the Aaron. Chris Maney, F2 Campos. And then we have got a beautiful mini diamond, Max Verstappen. Awesome. Love these. Number to 299. See if I show you. Uh, there we go. 170 of 299. And that is going out to Robert today. Driver of the day, appropriately in Netherlands. And Max Verstappen in the camera. Yeah, I reckon good luck taking Zandford off Max. Don't think you can have much luck there. I went there once as a early teen to Zandford. And there's a corner there with a camera. You can see it from the start finish. I think they, they did the orientation different that day to how they normally do it. I think it's now the first corner, but it was the last corner that weekend. Unreal. Like the, the banking on it, it's, it's almost NASCAR style. It's absolutely crazy. I think, I don't know if that's a Tarzan, the one they call Tarzan, but absolutely out of control. It just on TV, that kind of falls away, I don't realize, but standing there in person, nuts. Sergio in two, Carlos Sainz. Got Landon Norris, awesome pose, and French Toast in the refractor for the Alpha Terry others. So we're hitting everyone except Ricardo in that spot at the moment. We'll get there. Plenty, plenty of boxes left. Plenty of packs left. Carlos Sainz and Alex Albon. And we've got Zane Maloney for Roden Carlin and Nico Hulkenberg for Haas. Matthew Beekman. Actually, Matthew, I saw today that you grabbed both the Netherlands spots and suddenly a light bulb went off. Maybe it's not Beekman. Maybe it's Beekman. It is a bit of a Dutch name. George Russell for Mercedes. Logan Sargent for Williams. Which toast not in the refractor this time. And Valtteri Bottas. The Speed Demons, rolling out to Ben. Oh, it's not out to Ben. It's to Aaron Tucker. That's right. Your prediction. Haven't had a guess for a while. Russell Portrait. Red Checker. Nice. Okay. We haven't seen. You know what? We've only seen the one red, haven't we? I think we've only seen Red Checker, which was uh, Paris. Of course, we blasted past it by going super at some point. End printing play. Charles Leclerc into Fernando Alonso. Anton Senna in the Legends. Nice one there for Stu Mary. And Charles Leclerc in the camera. So I like that guess. A uh, red checker, I'd be all about it. Maybe a good one off the mini as well. Always like that. Fernando Alonso. Got a wolf. And got a nice checker. It's not red, but it's a checker. Love him. And there's Fernando Alonso at the Dirk. Very nice. I love these. Absolutely love them. Said it before, but whoever in the meeting room said, hey, we should have one like the checkered flag, I'll give that man a raise. What a great idea. And Lewis, a nice refractor there. Yeah, absolutely. It's hard enough to call you spot. May as well uh, go something massive. I agree with you. I completely agree with that. Got some more orders rolling in. Sergio Perez winning at Monaco. And then we've got Logan Sargent for Williams. One more Correa. This time, no auto for Van Amersfoort. And Max Verstappen in the camber. Yeah, we intertwine a bit of uh, predicting for this weekend tomorrow with the break, so it's going to be fun. We'll do the same on race day, of course. But we'll do a bit of poly uh, 
probably guessing. Sergio Perez, Ralph Boschung, Max Verstappen, and Esteban Ocon in the Speed Demons. Yep, I think it's uh, Karen Stone, even though she's got a very nice Nick DeVries there. What we would love is a Danny Rick there instead. Seth Vettel, driver of the day. Philip Boucher, at, what was I saying? I do Grand Prix, that's not true. Art Grand Prix. Sergio Perez. Carlos Sainz in the camera. Don't forget two time there is Nick DeVries and that kind of thing. It's always great trade bait as well, including your Futuro. Even if you hit big, but it's not the player you're after. Oh, what are we doing? What is that? Oh, that's a two colored. Okay. It's all good. That's all good. Still very nice though. Max Verstappen, Nico Hulkenberg. It looks like we are going orange red. Orange and red, and it is Lewis Hamilton. A beautiful shot of a car there. I think that is one of the shorter, harder to get. Not numbered though, but one of the harder to get multicolored ones. Very nice. That is going out to Phil Kasich. And a very nice refractor, Ayrton Senna. It was not easy to come by. We haven't seen very many of them. That one's out to Stu Mary. See box one kicking off in the background there. If you saw the backdrop, you're just tuning in. For a straight gold, we've got a straight orange auto for an F2 driver by the name of Juan Manuel Correa. But we're on big. Sorry, that was K Mag into Max Verstappen, and we're going Fuchsia Lava. And for Williams, we've got Alexander Albon out to 250. And it is number, there you go, number six of 250. The Albon spot with Aaron Tucker. And Sergio. Uh, let me have a look, Phil, because I was just wondering that same thing myself. Um, yes, red green. Red green is the shortest because I think it goes by you know the the first color, I suppose. So that one being orange red, it goes off. It sort of sits with the oranges. Red green seems to be the shortest. I oh, do you not have this one yet, Cal, the uh, the Albon. Cal's doing the full Fuchsia Lava set. I'm grabbing a couple of cards out of the States together to make that happen. And yeah, really, really cool. Cool way to do it. All right, let's get into box number two. See what else we can add back there. Chuck some more bangers up. Good luck for box number two. Nick DeVries. What's going on? There we go. Nick DeVries is the same Maloney. I thought we had a three card pack for a second. Just messing with me. Oh, we've got a rookie mini diamond. We have got Nick DeVries. Of course we do. Aaron, I know you're a Danny Rick fan, but I think that needs to end. I think you just need to change your preferences to Nick DeVries because then you are absolutely killing it. 195 to 299. Lovely. Seriously, you find a Nick DeVries collector and you just, just hand him a treasure trove. And Joe Guan Yu for Alpha. Sorry, Alpha Romeo. There's multiple Alphas. Alpha Romeo. That one's out to Kake Chung. I hope I'm saying that correctly. Watch, watch the Nick DeVries Super come out. We're just going to go bigger and bigger in Nick DeVries cards. Brad Benavides, Max Verstappen, award winners. We've got Sergio, back-to-back -back Red Bulls, 
And then we have got back to back to back Red Bulls in the Canberra Max Verstappen. Nice one there for Robert. Bruno Fermin for Alpine, Oscar Piastri, nice shot of him there for McLaren out to lane. Charles Leclerc in the Ferrari, and David Coulthard, another legend for Frack, they're very nice, it's two of them now, they are not easy to come by, and we've got two out to Stu Mary. You know what, Tara? If we pull, how about this? If we pull a Nick DeVries 25 or shorter, if I find one, you get a refund on the spot. So you can get it next time and go get Danny Rick. How's that for a bonus? You get a lot of laughs from me. You get a beautiful card. And you get a refund of your spot. God, I hope we get a super. It would be absolutely amazing. Pierre yeah, Gasly into Max Verstappen winning Canada. Max Verstappen probably winning something, but it doesn't say. And Valtteri Bottas in the Speed Demons. We've got Lance Stroll into Sergio Perez. And look at where are we going. Is it straight, straight purple? And it's very much upside down. And we've got another shot of car. It looks like nice, another Sergio Perez. And this, in fact, the same car. Oh, I said 72, sorry, let me say it in English, 72 of 399. And that is out to Robert. Nice, the Red Bull spot is building up bit by bit. And Lando Norris in the camera. Oh, that's the thing about having live recordings, Taryn. Anything I say is, uh, is binding. I try to renege, you just rewind, it's easy. Brad Benavides in PHM Racing. Yuki Sonoda popping up the first time for Alpha Tauri. Oscar Piastri. And George Russell in the camera. Yeah, it's not often you get an insurance deal going that way around, where if we hit, you get the insurance. Pretty good deal, I'd say. Max Verstappen. Roy Nassani. We've got a purple checker. And it's upside down. One of them has AWS on the wing. That's all we saw. Scoo. I'm not going to say it. It is Brary and it is Charles Leclerc. It might not be gold, but man, you are plugging away the purple Charles Leclerc's. That is the second number to 199, which is awesome. We've got the driver of the day in the background there and then this nice shot of the car. Plus a straight purple driver of the day. So there's three purple Charles Leclerc's. And Alessandro Aluni Bravi in the Fractor. Out to the Alfa Romeo others. Is Aaron Tucker. So it's good, it's a good pack for you there, Aaron. Logan Sargent into Charles Leclerc, why not? Fernando Alonso, and off the back, David Coulthard in the Speed Demons. Yeah, the Mini is definitely paying off. It definitely is. And the Ferrari spot does tend to go pretty hard. It's pretty rare that we don't see a lot of Ferrari. Jack Doohan into Sergio Perez. At the back here, we have got Chris Maney. Campos and Joe Guan Yu in the Canberra. Have we got what have we got? It is the multicolor. It always is very exciting, but breaks my heart slightly. Johan Daravala into Lando Norris. But again, the very nice orange and red. And we've got Frederick Vesti for Prima. In that F2 spot doing well. Always seems to go Scott Marsh. 
And then we've got Jahan Darvala in the refractor. Say it time and time again, but it's just so cool to think that some of these guys, and Oliver Behrman is, a, is an obvious example, but some of these guys might be in the F1 years from now. And, you know, we're collecting their rookie card at that point, but you've already got a whole bunch of F2 cards sitting there from 2023. I, I think that's that's absolutely awesome. Especially things like, you know, imagine one Manuel Correa makes it. You've got that sitting there. Just super cool. Max Verstappen into Nico Hulkenberg. In the checker, we've got Zane Maloney. Speaking of F2 drivers. And Carlos Sainz in the refractor. Because in other sports, like in baseball, this is... This is pretty much a prospect set, right? So you have to buy a product like this to get cards like the F2 cards. It's essentially baseball's equivalent. Uh, and it's like, I really like that, that it's in this. You don't get that with soccer either, you know? You don't, like, you get young players that are just starting out, but you're not going to get, like, academy cards or anything like that. So while sometimes we're in an auto and you say, well, I wish it was an F1 driver, I agree, of course, always the preference, but pretty cool still that they're prospects. Fernando Alonso into Dennis Hauger. Hauger? Let's say Hauger. Max Verstappen winning at Miami. And Logan Sargent in the Williams, 1977. Lando Norris, Enzo Fittipaldi. Manuel Correa, of course, grabbed him in the big auto already. Ed and Senna in the camber. That's legend there for Stu. The legend for Stu. Lewis Hamilton. And award winners Red Bull. What is that? That's that's a gold, gold checker. We are going out to 50. Going nice and short. Where's the star? There's the star. Let's see what we're doing. Toto Wolf. That is so cool. I think that is our first very short numbered Toto. Mr. Pumpernickel himself. Love it. Really cool. And that is off the mini, of course, because that is at Russell and other spot. So, Phil Marku, that is a very nice one for you there. Very nice. Very, very nice. I can't believe I don't have my Toto gifts ready. Disappointing. I could do that though, but man, very nice. So it was at 28 of 50. And I saw one of these in the very first box that we opened, the, the preview box we did. We had a Max Verstappen in the gold checker, but haven't seen very many since. So, so cool to see. Absolutely love them. Love them, love them. And then we got Logan Sargent in the refractor, rookie for Williams, which is out to James Lynn. Yeah, I like that. From the uh, team principles, he might be, well, other than Gunther, of course, how could he not be your favorite? I reckon Toto might be uh, a close second for me. Love it. Such beautiful cards, these gold waves. Not gold waves. Gold checker. Gold wave is beautiful as well, but this is a gold checker. Yeah, just a pair of golds in the middle with an orange next to it. One and a half boxes in, no worries. Numbers, man, come up with a figure. Is that me? I just feel spoken to when somebody says that phrase. Jack Doohan. Sergio Perez. Chris Maney. And Charles Leclerc in the Speed Demons. We have five packs of fun left. In what is essentially the FP3 of the uh, of the weekend. We've got our quali break tomorrow and our race break on Sunday, of course. Kevin Magnussen into Sergio Perez. Back we have got Lewis Hamilton. Sorry, that's on the back. What am I talking about? Off the back, we've got Logan Sargent in the refractor. But if you were asking me to, Phil, unfortunately, I don't know my Toyota Wolf market off the top of my head as much as I should. Logan Sargent for the Williams. I would very much be guessing. 
George Russell. Friends tossed. Did it properly for the first time tonight. And Jahan Darvala in the Speed Demons Refractor. Not to confuse anyone, they're always refractors. George Russell into Ayrton Senna. I think we are going straight green. We are. We don't see that one too often, it seems. Nice. For the Mercedes is George Russell. That spot is now properly kicking off. Off the Mini. The Mini's doing very well today. Oh, God, where are we? On his hand. It's hard to see. 23 of 99. Bit of funky scratching there on the right. You can probably see it lights up pretty good. Probably not as bad. You don't have it under a massive light, but a little bit of funky scratching there. But a very nice card nonetheless. George Russell out to Philip Marku. So back to back hits for you between Toto and George. And we've got George again in the camera. Why not? Cool shot at, shot at George as well. I like that one. All right, two to go. There's a Danny Rick. No numbering, but it is definitely, undisputedly, an Alpha Tari Danny Rick. That's a Darren. Charles Leclerc. Got a Wolf in the base. And Fernando Alonso in the refractor. All right, last pack magic. What can we do? Got Lance Stroll. Find that. Oscar Piastri. Felipe Drugovic. And Yuki Sonoda in the 1977 to wrap us up. Very nice. Very nice. Great break as always. But man, look at that numbering. Two boxes. Gold checker. Gold. Orange with an auto on it. Absolutely hectic. Oh, and a green to 99 as well. That certainly counts in that list. Tick. Let's have a look. I've seen plenty of orders come through, so let's have a quick look at what's going on, on the website, and we'll come back and do a quick recap of what we've just seen. And that would very much be our checklist. Here we go. One of them is gone, so that is the baseball sold out, which is the um, triple hobby and logo fractor. So series one hobby and logo fractor. Then let's have a look at the other baseball. Oh, that is moving very, very well. We have got, what is that, eight spots left between the Angels, the Athletics, the Blue Jays, the Giants, the Guardians, the Mets, the Rays, and the Yankees. Big spot there at the end. And this one's going to be a hell of a lot of fun. Big, big things can come out there. Uh, then we've got the Museum. Speaking of big things that can come out, looks like that's moving very nicely. Liverpool, Gerard and Keegan. Remember, this is 15% off everything you see here. As you check it out, you get 15% off as soon as you add it to cart. Let me actually see if I can demonstrate that example. Can I? Sort of. My screen just cuts it off, but you have to take my word. 15% comes off. Barcelona, Stoichkov, Clavert, Real Madrid, Carlos, Xavi, Alaba, Marseille, Bayern Munich, Beckenbauer, Müller, Leverkusen, AC Milan, Kakaba, Resi, Maldini, and Salzburg. And that is it. So that is, what is that? Six, eight spots as well. So that is very close to going. That will be Dan and his magic hands doing that one. So you know what that means. And then we have got Top's Finest Road to Euro. The brand new release today. We have got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that is very close to going as well. Belgium, De Bruyne and Courtois. Denmark, Schmeichel and others. England, Kane, Shira, Terry. France, Sedan, Colomani. Germany, Musiala, Müller. And Germany, Matthaus, Samer, and others. So all of Germany still there. Ireland, Israel, Poland, and Switzerland, which is 33. And Ukraine, which is 88. So not a whole lot left. We are looking pretty primed to go back to back to back to back, which is going to be absolutely awesome and a great way to kick off the weekend. All right, let's have a look. See what we got. That Red Bull spot going hard. We had Sergio in the purple. Charles Leclerc off the mini, 399. Also plenty of Charles purple. Same Maloney in the checker. 
Kurdic Vesti in the very nice orange and red. Speaking of orange and red, we had Lewis. And ooh, let's not throw the other cards around. There we go. David Coulthard in the Legends. Or Legends Refractor, I should say, sorry. Nick DeVries, Mini Diamond to 299. Part of the ever growing Nick DeVries collection in the Veil household. Alexander Albon in the Fuchsia Lava. Ethan Senna in the Refractor Legends. Fernando Alonso in the Checker. And we had Charles Leclerc going off a couple times, a couple more times, first in his car in the purple checker, and then driver of the day in the driver's parade by the look of it. Got Max in the mini diamond 299 driver of the day in Zandvoort. Retired sergeant, so I won't come race sergeant. Wait, is that for real? George Russell to 99. Can't tell if that's a meme or if that's real. <laughs> um, ooh, what do we got next? Probably Nick DeVries. Despite his rookie, it is difficult to go up against Mr. Toto. That is a very, very nice card. The straight gold never misses with tops. Certainly not in tops chrome. Absolutely beautiful. Then we had Captain Pumpernickel in the gold checker X Factor at the 50 off the mini. Going out to Phil Marku, and very, very nice, I would say, the card of the break without much of a doubt. Gold Auto, sorry, let me just take my colorblind glasses off. The Orange Auto, Juan Manuel Correa, number 2 of 25, out to Scott March. Very, very nice. Oh, shit, you're kidding. Alex cracked his tub, and they were like, Logan, get out of the car. Oh, man, that's brutal. Oh, that's brutal. <laughs> oh, man. Man, I mean, but to be fair, if it happened with Trident, I would do the same thing and write myself off and go, all right, Dan, you break, because, you know, those hands are made with magic, so. All right, guys, I'm going to jump off for a bit. I'll be back shortly with some baseball. Um, I reckon we go baseball, baseball if we can, and then we go over to Magic Hands over in Trident Northeast, or Atlantis, as he uh, started calling it. Um, and then Dan can uh, rip some absolute magic at a museum, and of course, you're a finest. But I'll be back shortly with more. Thank you. <laughs> 